Welcome back to more of Iron Head's Festism Regime, or I mean Ikachan. Last time we um, met Pinky, but in this part we're gonna go and try to collect this experience. Now, as you remember before my previous mention, this block will appear, but because I got them that capacitor or whatever it's called, I can now collect all this fish without even worrying at all. I mean, if that was a solid block, yeah, we should never come in here, but... Now we got the capacitator, or whatever it's called, and... We can now collect this all. Let's move carefully through here. And collect all these experience. Awesome! More fishies, more fishies, 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 fishies! Sheesh, I tell you, all this fish is gonna turn me into Smeagol. And no, I am not going to sing that annoying god ridden song. No, actually, you'll never see me sing in any videos whatsoever. You must be crazy to think that I would actually sing for you, my audience. Of course, my audience would probably love to hear me sing. Not. That crab. You're way too cheap to live in this place. Anyways, let's go get Pinky. Ikachan, I didn't think you would come back. I knew you were a good guy. I knew it. I guess I'll go home now. And what, you're not gonna escort her home? Selfish, Ikachan. Ooh, just barely missed that um, puffer or... I forgot what they're called. I think they're mentioned in the Cave Story credits where their actual little name appear, but... I'm not gonna bother to figure that out right now. Thank you for rescuing her. That we are in your death. Oh sure, you oh sure you yell at me for taking your pearl when most certainly I didn't steal it from you. I was given to it. I don't have much to give of you. If you want this glow Aha! It is a globe fish. You can have it. My mom says it's too dangerous for me to eat. Cannibalism is not healthy, kids. Because of all the earthquakes, we've been isolated from the rest of the sea. And her head made us all paranoid so that he can keep us under control and himself in peril. We have to stop him. You mean end the fascism regime? How? Why would we? I can't thank you enough for saving Pinky. I mean, why would we want to end a fascist regime? Adolf Hitler. Oh, yeah. So here we go, um, being democratic and ending regimes of fascism. We must defeat Iron Head. God, World War II all over again. Actually, before we give it to him, I so um, look up the globe fish platter. A very fancy dish, sought after many, but be careful. It's not cooked well, it is poisonous. And because fishes don't have stoves, uh... Yay, we get to poison Ironhead. Oh, globe head. I'm going to cut it. Uh, bring it to Ironhead immediately. Right here. So, Carrie's on um, sleeps the opening for us. Now, where could the carry be? Ugh. Oh, fish. Poison. Damn it. Hold on. You been eating Ironhead's food? Considering he's probably fastest, I don't really mind. But you're probably being um, taking those pearls as well. Now when you meet Ironhead, it's a good idea to talk to him underneath, so... Who is this? Ironhead. Him. He's the one who has been stealing food from the storehouse. 
He tricked me too. He tricked me into giving him a pearl. You twat. Hmm. Who is this puny squid? It doesn't matter. I shall crush him. That is why I wanted to go underneath him. So I can just bunk him um, right there and then. Now, Iron Head, you can only strike him um, in the belly. If you actually go. Oh, this battle is going smoothly. If he actually goes into your range. Um, he'll actually charge right after you. Well, luckily, he seems to be too stupid to even try to do that. I mean, of course he's not gonna charge at me when I'm actually recording. There he goes, now he charges. Now we can go into the actual cycle, just try to swim midair and he'll charge and strike him underneath. Very easy final boss, I gotta say that. See, Pixel can make easy games, nothing like Cave Story, even though that Cave Story is relatively easy. See? Yeah, I'm calling Cave Story a bit hard, even though that I'm a guy who played through I Wanna Be The Guy. No, I have not been able to beat in I Wanna Be The Guy, even though that compared to other games, I Wanna Be The Guy is piss easy. Defeated by your squid kid, you are a worthy opponent. What have you done again? Trick Gary into giving you a pearl? You are clever too. Whatever, isn't it my problem? You deal with it. After being cut off from the rest of the sea, I have had nothing good to eat. Look at me. I'm famished. You're a giant. Jump as you will, little squid. If you find any good food, bring it to me. Uh, Pinky, do you have any more globefish? <laughs> Alright, I'll just end it right now, okay? See you guys next time.